Hello guys, this is a coding lab tutorial video for the problem concat in the string 1 section. Given two strings, append them together, and let's concatenation and return the result. However, if the concatenation creates a double car, then omit one of the cars, so abc and cat yields ab cat. In this problem, you're given two strings, and you're supposed to combine them together. However, if the letter at the end of the first string is the same as the first letter of the second string, one of them has to be removed. In the first example, when the string abc and string cat are combined, the result is ab cat. This is because there are two of the same letters in the combined string and one of the letters has to be removed. In the second example, the return string will be dog cat because the last letter of the first string is not equal to the first letter of the second string. In the third example, the answer is ABC because when the non-empty string and the empty string are combined, the return answer will be the same thing as the non-empty string. This is due to the fact that there is no letter or word in the second string. Even though it's empty, it is still considered a string since there are double quotation marks. To solve this question, there are four cases that we have to check. In the first two cases, we will check if string A or string B is an empty string. And we can do this by writing if the length of A is equal to 0, then we can return B. Else, if the length of b is equal to 0, then we can just return a because the combined result of non empty string and an empty string will just be the same thing as the non empty string. For the third case, we check if there are two of the same letter or not, and we can do this by using the string method substring. We write a dot substring a dot length minus one dot equals b dot substring zero comma one. And basically this checks the last index of the first string and the first index of the second string. And then if they're equal to each other, then you return a plus b dot substring one. And rewrite b dot substring one because we don't need two of the same letters. And this will not include the first letter of the second string in the return string. Lastly, if the combined string does not match any of the conditions that I said before, then you return a plus b. Thank you for watching this tutorial video, and goodbye.